During the height of the Cold War, America's entire nuclear arsenal, thousands of warheads that could end civilization, sat behind eight zeros. Not a military cipher, not a secret code, just eight zeros. Their reason? The Pentagon worried that complex passwords might slow down launch time. Because when you're heading toward nuclear annihilation, every second counts. But let's fast forward to modern times for our next embarrassing password. Mark Zuckerberg, the architect of a trillion dollar social empire, got his Instagram hacked because his password was da da da. The man who knows what you ate for breakfast in 2012 couldn't be bothered to create a more complex password than baby's first words. We're not just bad at passwords, we're catastrophically historically terrible at them. Your brain can hold about seven random digits at once, but modern security demands you juggle hundreds of accounts, each needing capitals, numbers, letters, and the entire ASCII table. The result? A password database that have been pwned that's grown to hundreds of millions of stolen credentials, each one a digital skeleton key, each one probably ending with an exclamation point. For the last few decades, Microsoft's been building walls against human nature, requiring passwords with capital letters, numbers, and special characters. But humans always find a path of least resistance. We just add bang to the end and get back to watching PyCon talks at 2x speed. The average Fortune 500 company burns $16 million yearly in password management, and passwords still cause 81% of breaches. We're spending Ferrari money for Honda security. But while we're busy adding exclamation points to password 123, something bigger's been brewing. Inside your phone sits a mathematical fortress, a biometric chip more secure than any password ever created. When you tap your fingerprint, you're not just scanning an image. You're triggering a cryptographic thunderdome of public keys locked in silicon so secure even the FBI's best zero days can't touch it. Meanwhile, Apple, Google, and Microsoft Microsoft, three giants that normally would sue each other over the color blue, had joined forces in a password extinction event. They're building passkey support directly into our devices. Your face is becoming your universal key to the kingdom. The apocalypse for passwords isn't just coming, it's already here. But every ending is just a new beginning. And while we're rushing to replace passwords with faces, the machines are learning to wear our skin. AI-generated faces are flooding the digital world, getting better every day at being you. We're trading one security nightmare for another, speedrunning toward a future where your biggest vulnerability might be your own reflection. This has been the Security Report, and remember to always begin secure.